What's up, Salmon Squad? I am the Game Salmon, and welcome to Can a Cute Ghost Story Be Spooky? I think so. If you guys remember that pancake horror show kind of game, this is made by the same dev, Dema Studios. So I think we can expect a lot of silliness, a lot of really fantastic jokes, as well as maybe a few spooks in between. So here we go. Oh, and like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, and leave a comment down below. Gotta help out that YouTube algorithm. Hi, kids. Ready to be scared? I don't want to lie. It will be a very scary story. If you get scared easily, you are free to leave. Are you still here? So... Do you want to hear the story? Okay. Don't complain with me if you cry. I warned you. Well, in a dark cemetery full of scary ghosts, there's an old house haunted by a specter called Jimmy. Of course. Jimmy is only 374 years old. He's basically just a little kid like you. And in this house that our story begins, like every night, Jimmy takes his favorite hat in front of the mirror before leaving the house. No one can understand how special the hat is to Jimmy. It was given to him by his mother for his 276th birthday. If only someone tried to steal it, ha ha ha, Jimmy would probably go crazy. Okay, well, I'll take my hat and leave the house. So I'm playing as a ghost, okay, that's fine. Everything is all happy and dandy so far. So we'll take that. Oh, I got a little party hat. Look at me. Look at me go. All right, out we go. Um, ah, left. This it's is left a click to interact. And spooky night, but Jimmy doesn't care. He is always happy. Usually, Jimmy greets the family before going to the town. He is such a thoughtful guy. Oh. Okay, I gotta go to my family. Historic cemetery, uh, commemorative obelisk for the coolest dudes of the past, man. Oh, God. David, he tasted a strange new drink in the banquet during a political conference. Connor, he accidentally donated one dollar to a charity. Dylan, he wanted to save money on medical care. Ha, <laughs> I get it, because he's dead. All right, I'm going to stop reading tombstones, because because there's a lot of them. Oh, except for Eddie, because he always liked cats. Maybe it's in here. Warning, abandoned ancient crypt. Oh, can I not go in there? Where's my family? Hello, family. How are you today? Come on, guys. Seems to be in a mortuary. Answer me, please. Okay. I'll play some music. Death is too long to be bored. All right, I'll, I'll play some music. That's fine. Oh, can I play it? I hope you like this music. It will last approximately 20 hours. Jimmy, stop this music now. Sorry, but this music cannot be stopped. Now I'm going to town. Bye. Jimmy, come here. You. Wow, that's why I love Jimmy. He is so innocent and naive. Luckily, I applied some family friendly filters to this story. We certainly don't want to see Jimmy cry. After two hours, Jimmy has finally arrived. And now he's so hungry. Luckily, he knows an excellent Italian restaurant in town. It's a perfect night to eat pizza. Okay, I'm down for some pizza. I'm curious when the horror will start. Oh, I thought that oh, was- Oh, another balloon is pop. Hey dude, don't be mad. Do you want to get a pizza with me? I'll pay for it. Really? Thanks, buddy. Anyway, I'm Dave, it's nice to meet you. I'm Jimmy, nice to meet you too. Follow me to the restaurant. Now Jimmy and his new friend are ready to have a good night of fun. Jimmy, nice to see you again. Is the guy next to you your new friend? Yes, his name is Dave. He likes to eat pizza like me. Well, Dave, you are in the right place. I make the best Italian pizzas in town. Now take a seat so I'll take your orders. Thanks, you seem like a very nice person, Mario. Okay, guys, which pizza do you want to order? Oh. Oh, choose pizza from the menu? Okay, let's see. Four season pizza, margarita pizza, and mushroom pizza. My favorite out of these three has got to be the margarita. Let's go to margarita pizza. Let's go. Good choice, Jimmy. And you, Dave, what do you want to order? I would like to taste the most traditional pizza in Italy, the pineapple pizza. Pineapple pizza is a traditional Italian pizza? <laughs> Jimmy, you didn't tell me your new friend was so funny. I'm not joking. I'm serious. Ah. Uh. 
Jimmy, how many times have I told you not to let these pizza criminals into my restaurant? Sorry, Mario. I thought Dave was a normal ghost. Guess I was wrong. Now, can I have my pizza? Of course. You always remain my favorite little customer. One hour later. Mario's pizza is always good. Uh -huh. Yes, it's true. But to be honest, Mario seems strange these nights. Why is he strange, narrator? Mario seems more angry lately. I think something is going on. Yeah, maybe you're right. But it doesn't really matter now. I want to go to sleep. I'm tired. Okay, we'll talk about it tomorrow. Another balloon just popped. Is there anything over here? I see candles. What is this? Oh god, it's a pentagram. <laughs> just, <laughs> Hello! Hi, demon! Put the hat near the mirror and go to sleep. Okay. So, boom. And Betty Bag time. Let's go. Press here for additional fun. What the hell just happened? Am I dreaming? It just says enjoy the party. I don't know if I want to enjoy the party. I think the party might be a little scary. Is Mario after me? <gasps> my hat! Oh no! This hole stole my hat! Now the party's ruined. Oh, someone's knocking on the door. Well, maybe it's my friend Dave. Go to the door. I don't like this. Game, what are you preparing me for? <laughs> Do I still go to the door? I'm just gonna check the door real quick. Jimmy, Jimmy, God! my balloons were stolen. I'm very worried. Be calm. In my party, there are many balloons. Follow me. Thanks, friend. I knew I could trust you. Dave, it's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be good. What happened here? The party's gone? I'm sorry, Dave. There are no more balloons now. Dave? What? what? Dave, wh where are you? Mission, where is Dave? Guys, it's cute, but it's scary. <laughs> what a simple game, but it's giving me the spooks. Hold. <gasps> what a strange dream. Luckily, it's all fake. Nobody stole my... Oh, fuck. No. Someone stole my favorite hat like in my dream. The thief must have made a hole in the wall to get into my house. Henry, are you there? Can you hear me? What should I do now? Narrator? Now this is weird. Last night he told me he had to tell me something important today. And now he's gone. Oh, it's Dave. Better open the door. Jimmy! Jimmy! My balloon- Yeah, I know. Your balloons have been stolen and you're very worried. What? How did you know that? Are you the thief? It's not me. I just had a premonitory dream. Tonight, even my favorite hat was stolen. Before knocking on your door, I saw someone enter the ancient abandoned crypt. Maybe it's the thief! Really? Let's go, friend. We must take back what is ours. <laughs> the spooks are happening, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, there's the hole. So that's how the bad person stole my hat. Jimmy, so... stop. I, I can't go with you. What's the problem, dude? Don't you want to get your balloons back? Yeah, I want them back. I'm just afraid of abandoned places. You will not be alone. You'll be with me. Here we go. I'm sorry, Jimmy, but I'm staying here. Ah, you're just a wimp. I don't need you. I'll go in there alone. Oh god. I don't need Dave. I can find my hat by myself. No. Explore the crypt and find the thief? I don't want to though. It's gonna be spooky. Hello, Mr. Hat Thief. Man, there's a lot of stairs in this crypt. We are going down pretty far. I mean, we're... I wonder how deep we're going. Gosh. Uh, ooh. What is this place? I've never been here before. <gasps> oh, okay. So, I gotta find the right planks that will not lead me to my doom. Maybe this, maybe this, maybe this. Yo, let's go! No! Oh, I thought I had it. Oh, I was so close! Here we go, here we go. There we go. Uh-oh. Aha, the thief. Now that he's not looking at me, I better find a weapon to hit him. Can I just go near to him and just say hi? Oh, he doesn't care. Okay. 
Well, time to find a weapon. Oh, I can't go that way. Okay. Danger, do not enter. Very dark area. Challenge accepted? Oh, I can't go in there. Never mind. Oh, plank. Ooh, this piece of wood could come in handy. All right, buddy. Are you ready for the bonks? Oh, this hurts. Who are you? I'm Jimmy, and I'm here to get my hat back. You understand that, thief? I'm not a thief. Wait, what? So what are you doing here, then? I'm the famous Professor William. I'm from England, here to study these ancient inscriptions. What? They look like they're drawn by five-year-old kids. You're just a troglodyte. You don't understand the importance of history. I'm a what? 15 centuries ago, Lord Frederick was governor and... Uh, I don't have time for that now. I really have to find my hat. Okay, if it helps. I saw a dude with a chef's hat a while ago. He was holding a red hat in his hand. My hat is red, and the dude over there with the chef's hat is Mario. So where did it go? I, I really need to know. He entered the door near me. Thanks, Professor. You're pretty helpful, actually. Uh, where do you think you're going? You have to do one thing. Did you think hitting me with a piece of wood had no consequences? Uh, okay, what, what, what do you want me to do? You have to bring me an ancient map. It's located in a very dangerous area of the crypt. Some say they have seen strange ghosts in this area. But don't worry, this is just a story made up to scare kids. Moreover, it's very dark there. Luckily, I'm also an inventor. I created special glasses to see better in the dark. Do you want them? Yes? Of course I do? I'm glad someone tries my inventions. I'm sure these glasses will be very useful for you. Okay. All right, well, I guess we're going in here to find an ancient map. Wow, these glasses are very useful. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> I, I- Oh, what the heck is that? I'm not prepared for like, when they actually throw something at me because it keeps throwing me silly things. <laughs> it reminds me a lot of like, the beginning stages what of- What? Oh god. It reminds me a lot of the, the early Man, stages these glasses are useless. of- Battery ran out immediately. Spooky's jump scare mansion. That's all I was trying to say. Oh, I can barely see. Down floor. Maybe if I follow it, I'll find something. All right, that'll work. That'll help. I'm cool with that. Thank you, arrows. The map. I better take it and get out of this dark place. Got it. Okay. Gotta work my way back. All right. Um. I hope I can figure out my way back. <gasps> okay, okay, all right. You're just gonna be a big old butt. I see you. Okay, I got this. I got this. I got this. I think I know what I need to do. They're gonna come this way. <gasps> There's a lot of them after me. Great. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. I'm amazing. I'm amazing. I got by the spoopy ghosts. Oh no, I don't know where I'm going. Am I going the right way? Am I going? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, oh, Professor William. Whoa, I found the map. Excellent. Was it difficult to find? Yes. Not so much. Mostly it was just very dark in that place. Luckily you had my special glasses. Was it useful? No. No, I'm telling the truth, man. Truth. Honestly, your glasses suck. The battery literally ran out in like 10 seconds. You should like get a real job. And, uh, sorry, but I have to find my hat. I've wasted way too much time with you. Oh, he's all sad now. I feel bad. All right, whatever. All right, good. Time to find the hat. Come on, Mario. Where's my hat? My hat. Congratulations, Jimmy. You did it. What? Yeah, Jimmy, congratulations. Uh, can someone explain to me what's happening? We stole your hat just to create an adventure for you. We only did it because today is your birthday. Guys, my birthday's not today. Also, someone has to give me some money to repair that wall of my house. Oh, <laughs> Jimmy, look behind you. A flying unicorn. Where is it? Phew. Uh, guys, where are you? Come back. Like, I really want that money. Well, this is the end of our story. I hope the story wasn't too scary for you. Now Jimmy will have to pay for the damage with his own money. But in the end, he found his favorite hat. And this hat, it's me. Yeah, kids, I'm a talking hat and narrator of this story. Ha ha ha. No! Uh, yes! Yes! 
Yes! Oh, the twist ending! I never saw it coming! <laughs> All right, okay, Dima, I loved it, okay. I love, I love this type of just silly, ridiculous humor. I love it, it's great! It's fantastic! And, and like, like it's not an overly scary game. It has some spooks in there, but that's just because I flinch a lot, so. <laughs> oh, I love it. Alrighty, well, that is it for Can a Cute Ghost Story Be Spooky? I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully Demo Studios will release more videos like this because I like the humor. A lot of you guys seem to enjoy the pancake horror show that I released several months ago, and so... Hey, maybe, uh, maybe more will come out in the future. But until then, thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end cards at the end of this video. Also, be sure to like and subscribe if you have not already done so. I love you guys so much. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy. Stay happy. I will see you guys later. Goodbye.